You know what? Normally I edit all of this out of the video and we just don't do it. I'm leaving it in. People said they wanted more of this. They want me to leave in, to not edit out as much. So this is what you're going to get. This is your fault. All of this, all of what's happening right now, entirely your fault. Do you see this? Do you see it? Fridge! A fridge! A real a, a box of coldness and extra coldness underneath. My fridge. It's even got that new fridge smell. And look, a freezer. We drop. Oh my god. The freezer space? What? What? Are you. Look how deep those drawers are. I have not enough things to free. This is mostly gonna be pet seeds that are going in there. Big shelf, little shelf, easy slide. Easy slide. I'm not, I'm not sure what the purpose of this is. If someone would like to tell me um, why I, I need a sliding shelf, I'm not sure. Oh, it bims. Listen, listen to the bim. Wow. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do in my life now. Got a fridge, that's it. Peaked. Might as well retire at this point. What am I gonna do with my time now? Still haven't built that hamster cage. Did I just break the clicky? <gasps> Why don't you do the clicky? I've located the problem. This pen does not contain a pen. It contains a spring. Apparently I've taken the pen out of this at some point to do who knows what with, because <laughs> I can't remember. Um, and I just didn't put it back and now it's lost to time and my pen doesn't do a clicky. Hi, by the way, uh, welcome to this video. I don't know what we're doing in it. I'm not sure if this is just gonna be a vlog or if I'm actually, if I have a plan. Maybe I'll do a project halfway through. Who knows? I genuinely don't know what we're doing today. Um, and probably most of it won't be. Oh, I have a whole box of like cardboard and stuff that I forgot. It's right there in front of me and I'm seeing it now and I'm remembering that I have it. But I want to turn into like um, logs. Like, you know, you know cork logs, those big chunky boys that look so good in natural style enclosures? That rattling is annoying. Well, they're expensive. And I also can't find them anywhere. And the village that I've moved to is even more rural than the last rural village that I lived in. Rural, 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 rural. I can't say my R's. I live in a werewolf village. That just sounds like werewolf village. <gasps> How cool would it be to, no, it wouldn't be cool to live in a werewolf village. Think that through, you would try and pet them. The village I live in now is more rural than the last rural village I lived in. And this one does not have a pet shop. Ironically though, immediately after moving out of my last village, they opened up a new really nice pet shop that's full of these cute little fat birds that I want to squish and they're in the window and you see them and they're fluffy and it's like mm. can never own birds, will probably never own birds but I, I want to know someone who owns birds so I can be a bird auntie auntie auntie? auntie bird no I'm pro bird, I like birds I just don't want to own birds myself except for chickens and ducks, I would like some ducks I know ducks are assholes and that's why I vibe with them I want my own little pet assholes so the, the, the village that I left now has a really nice pet shop the village that I'm in does not have a pet shop it has a pet shop but it's, it's a dog food and cat food shop pet shop and I can't remember what pet shop has to do with anything that we're talking about oh cork, uh, cork, cork, wood tunnels, that's the ones expensive, don't have a pet shop nearby that sells any small pet supplies don't have an Amazon here Do uh, the concept of, 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 of same day, next day delivery, don't know it. Don't know her. No, not a clue. What? What? Also, getting parcels delivered directly to your front door instead of them being sent to the post office and the post office sending you a letter that says, hey, we've got a parcel, yours, we don't want it. If you don't come get it in two weeks, we're getting rid of it. The clock is ticking, on you come. And then pinning up that parcel slip somewhere where you are definitely going to see it every single day so you won't forget it, except you end up seeing it every single day so it blends in the background so you forget it so your parcel gets sent back and you lose the stuff that you paid money for and you can't convince the company that you didn't get it. This story may or may not be based on true events. What were we talking about? Cork logs. Okay. <laughs> You know what? Normally I edit all of this out of the video and we just don't do it. I'm leaving it in. People said they wanted more of this. They want me to leave in, to, to not edit out as much. So this is what you're gonna get. This is your fault. All of this, all of what's happening right now, entirely your fault. So if we order anything from Amazon, you've got to order it from a different country, which means you're paying a ridiculous amount in shipping and you have to wait a million weeks before it actually arrives and you have to wait for the post office to send you a message and then you have to remember to actually go and get the parcel. So I was thinking, um, why don't I just make fake cork logs? I have no idea how I'm going to do this or if it's going to be any good or if it's going to work. Uh, we're going to wing it and hope for the best, which is pretty much just my life. But let's have a go and and... Try and make some cork logs that cost significantly less 
than real cork logs. Since they'll be made out of cardboard and cardboard is made out of tree, won't they technically be real logs? So here's what may turn out to be a terrible plan. I have these packing boxes. Essentially what I plan to do is mulch this down into paper pulp and kind of like paper mache it around frame to make it look like a cork round, maybe. Portable bathtub. It's a plastic box filled with hot water. And on wheels, which means I can do this. Ah, no, don't do that. No, don't do that. Oh my goodness, don't do that. I'm just really excited about this project. Why would you do that? It's very rude. What have I become? Making things slightly easier on myself by breaking this down into small parts. And that way it should mulch a little faster. Uh. There we go. It's a good thing I sat up for that one because otherwise it would have projectiled out the front and this would be an entirely different recipe. Suez Canal episode two. This one's a bit of a fighter so we're just gonna hold it underneath until the bubbles stop. He loves me, he loves me not. He loves me. He loves me not. Oh, this is so much effort. It doesn't taste good. Why do hamsters chew on this stuff? It tastes awful. Mm -mm. Oh, not good. No. Do not recommend. You're not gonna find this one in my recipe book. That's pretty much all I can be bothered to do at this point, so I'm just gonna leave it now. Um, I'm gonna say overnight, overnight, until I remember about it again, and uh, come back once it's mulched up and do something with it. Oh, you said box diorama. Right, cause um, well, I've made a box of diarrhea. Today, children, we're playing sewage plant. Sifting out the poop, sifting out the poop. Mmm, mulch. Nice, tasty, healthy mulch full of fiber. If I'm honest, Harrison, I find your judgment a little bit hypocritical right now. This was not my idea. I, well, it, it, it was my idea, but this, this was not my idea. The idea was mine, but this was not my idea. Was, mm. I do appreciate that you're trying to promote the merch, though. That, that I will not, I will not let that go unrecognized. Good job. The service in this restaurant is atrocious. They haven't even given us knives and forks. Let me just move my leaky cow pad to the side for one moment. Allow me to introduce you to plastic. On wood! Allow me to show you a close-up of tonight's meal. Mm, delicious! Uh, this, this, this is a plastic water bottle, much like the one you see here, which I have sliced and sliced and then sliced and then hot glued onto a breadboard. And if I thought it through, I would have hot glued it onto cardboard because I don't... I... I'm not sure I'm gonna get it off again. So this will be the mold that I'm building the tunnel around that will hopefully make it somewhat tunnel shaped. For additional assistance, we have the film of clinging, which only clings to itself and nothing else. Wrap you up like tomorrow's lunch before I cover you in yesterday's dinner. Wow, the talent, the skill, you could not find this anywhere else. Nobody else has given you this kind of quality. Trum trum, eat your heart out. I'm not sure if they're still mad at me. Probably. Approach the bench and confess your crimes. We're just, we're just gonna, like, squidge. Just squ use the excess water that's still in, ow, my hand, oh my god, I have a welt from where I slapped myself with the glove. We shall use the excess moisture, I'm sorry, the excess moisture to mold this together and create the tunnel of our dreams. It's the tunnel of my dreams, there's a lot more naked people in it. Beggars can't be choosers though. Hi Erin, do you know what cork looks like? Cause this is not it. I harvested this log from the cacao tree. Of all the things I've made in my life, this is definitely on my top 10 list of things that are just awful. Squishy, 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 squishy. If you could just like 
retain some kind of shape. I'd like that a lot. We're losing him, Doctor! If you needed a life-saving surgery and I was the only surgeon available, would you just die? I'm surprised how many people on the internet don't know that I'm a qualified surgeon. I went to school with someone who didn't believe that space existed. And this is before the flat earth conspiracy. Like, this is before the internet was the way that it is now. She just, she just came up with that on her own. I'm very frightened for where this girl is in life today. Okay, I feel, I feel, I feel, I'm feeling, the feelings are feeling that this is where we probably need to stop. Now, I say we like you're involved. I realize none of this is your fault, but I will be dragging you into the blame. By watching my videos, you are consenting to it being your fault. I think if I add any more to this, then it's never actually gonna dry, so I have to leave it, leave it at this point, um, put it out in the sun for, oh, who knows how long. A day, two days, a year, hopefully not more than a day or two, because otherwise this video is never gonna, <laughs> it's never gonna get out. Or maybe I should just end the video here and not let you see the end result. That would be fun for me. I'm gonna go put this out in the sunshine and hope for the best. I made something awful and now you can make it too. Honey, dinner's ready. It worked. It's a tunnel, it's dry, it's hard, it's perfectly safe to be chewed on. Final rating, does it look like the thing I was trying to make? Eh, mm. Only if you don't know what cork looks like. Will it work in a natural cage? Yes, absolutely. Was it easy to make? Technically, yes, it was very easy to make. I just am very cack-handed about everything I do and so I made it more difficult than it needed to be. And it, to be honest, if I did this one again, I'd make it on a metal frame rather than a plastic one. That way you could have just shoved it in the oven to dry it rather than leaving it outside for three days, um, which really was the most time consuming thing. <laughs> if you were doing this properly, you leave the cardboard to mulch probably for only an hour or two. I, 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 <laughs> only an hour or two. It doesn't need to be left as long as I did. There's a spider on my desk. Oh, your little splat spider, hi. You're very cute. I'd use something oven safe for the frame and I'm thinking probably like chicken wire covered in foil would be the best option. And I'd also consider making it a little thinner because now I'm looking at it, it is quite a thick boy. I didn't need to put in quite as much thickness as I did and that definitely contributed to the long time it took to dry. And for the final marks, is it budget friendly? Yes, it heck it is. This cost me absolutely nothing to make. Literally nothing. This is just recycled materials from around my home. So, I mean, basically, if, if you want a natural looking tunnel -y, tubey thing and cork grinds are out of your budget or just hard for you to get hold of, this is probably your next best solution. However, if cork grinds are within your budget and easy to get hold of, just, just, just buy the cork grinds. Seriously, just buy them. Just do it. But obviously it's not just tunnels you can make with this method. As long as you have a mold in the shape of the thing you want, you can make pretty much anything. And since I am far too tired to do a proper outro today, uh, thanks for watching. Bye! Oh. Hello. Easy slide. For sponge. <laughs> Operator's manual. Badge for you. A badge for you. I meant it. I'm energy efficient. <laughs> I love how you kept this all day for me. I love you so much, Bean. Come here. We Come. Did. Give me your cold produce. Did you keep the receipt? Because that's how yes, that's it's how it somewhere. Warranty. I signed it and I put it somewhere. Oh fuck. Nice tie. Oh yeah. It's been oh, open too long. That's so musical. It levels up. Ah. It's, it's a bubble thing. Oh, it's stopped. <laughs> I was on my own today. <laughs> Why does he have... Oh! oh! I'm so sorry. Did you rip his tail fur off? I didn't think it was that sticky. I thought it was just... A... I thought he just caught his tail off. <laughs> Eggy! What? Oh! Eggy! Eggy! Magic! Ah! Chocolate. Yeah. <laughs>